New at 11, the owner of the dog who died after being attacked by two pit bulls hopes her dog's death is not in vain. A neighbor was walking Princess when she died. Nine on your sides, Ashley Zilka spoke with the woman whose dog will never come home. Police say two pit bulls attacked and killed a Sheltie right here in this field. Now that dog owner has been cited, but Princess's owner says more needs to be done. We have no children, so she was our child. Like any other day, Doris Olison's neighbor picked up her dog, two-year-old princess, at her home in Hamilton. He always did that. He would be here about 8 o'clock every morning and would walk her for maybe an hour if it wasn't too hot. But this time it would be different. Two pit bulls got loose and mauled princess. The neighbor was heartbroken. Oh, man. He said he was sorry over and over and over. Um, Butler but County Dog Warden Curd Merb says officers chased the pit bulls for nearly a half hour. At one point, the dogs charged at them. They were going in yards, jumping fences. Uh, we've had to divert several people, you know, riding bikes, walking, get them off the streets because these dogs were not friendly to people or animals. Merb says their owner eventually pulled up in a car and the pit bulls jumped in. Haley Suffrage has been issued several citations. Her boyfriend, Roger Pearson, is still in shock. I've had little kids come over, play all the time with them. Yes, I'm frustrated with that the law doesn't work, that they take care of those dogs. But on the other hand, I just hurt so bad. Merb says the pit bulls will have to be neutered and microchipped. They must also be registered as dangerous dogs. In the meantime, Pearson says he would like to talk to Princess's owner. I want to say sorry because I know that uh, a, a dog could be a important part of a family. Olison says she needs time to grieve. And even though she looked terrible, I'm still glad that I at least could say goodbye. The dog warden says the pit bull's owner could now face jail time. The investigation is ongoing. Reporting in Hamilton, Ashley Zilka, 9 on your side.